Well, tonight there are some new and disturbing developments surrounding yesterday's deadly shooting in Kokomo. Police arrested an elementary school student in connection with the crime. Rich Van Wyck spent the day in Kokomo gathering the details. The suspected killer is a juvenile, younger than a teenager. For that reason and others, police are saying very little about this case. It is apparent, though, they believe this was no accident. The 11-year-old is locked inside the juvenile center, accused of shooting 28-year-old Randall Rogers in the head. Police descended on their home Wednesday afternoon while neighbors watched. I was, I was shocked. You know, I was really shocked. I couldn't believe it. Ronald Ewing knows the child. They've been buddies for years. Josh trying to figure out where he, how to get the gun, you know, where the gun come from. Because I didn't, he didn't seem like the kind of kid that, that would hurt anybody. If the child was an adult, a department news release says the criminal charge would be voluntary manslaughter. That's an intentional killing, according to Indiana law, committed in anger or the heat of the moment. The sight of police with the 11 year old is something Ewing won't forget. And he got out of the police car and he went in, in the house and he was screaming and crying. And Rogers and the child live together in the home. Police say they are related but aren't saying how. Police aren't saying what may have led up to the investigation, what kind of gun is involved or how a child got hold of it. It is, they say, an ongoing investigation. Rich Van Wyck, Channel 13. Eyewitness News.